Hello. 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 Okay. Um. As I say, guys, I'm coming out with a new Naruto type movie of my own. I'm probably going to get flagged or copyrighted, but, you know, I got to do what I got to do. So, I want to thank everyone for tuning in and watching these. I just made it to 900 and freaking 70 some subscribers in less than two hours. So, whoever is promoting me or, you know, sharing my stuff, I want to thank you dearly and shout out to you. So, thank you, everybody, for your support. Uh, I want to thank everyone. So I'm changing my name on Twitch to Savage Life TV. So what that will mean is that I'll be doing some savage shit. So I'll be making some videos on my life. But you know, sometimes I, sometimes you just gotta you know go back and think about your past. You know, because I learned a lot from my past. Cause, you know, let me tell you a story. This is gonna be a kaiju tale. Hold on, let me put on some sad music. Alright, guys. <sighs> Here we go. Guys. I learned a lot by, you know, just losing so many people in my life. My cousin, he committed suicide. My uncle, he's on his deathbed right now. And... I lost my father when I was only 21, about to be 22. He died three days before my birthday, and he really wanted to be there for my birthday. You know, I'm sorry for anyone that I ever fucked over. You know, I fucked my ex. Not so much as my ex, but my friend's ex-girlfriend behind his back. You know, shout out to Gary Nelson. I want to thank everyone for tuning in, you know, for you guys are really good to me like I've done so much shit in my life that it's just fucked up like I got accused of molesting a child I got you know there's just a lot of stuff you know that created me you know I just want to do something better than I was before like you know so I'm trying to be a different person than I am before I know that makes no sense but literally I I'm I don't fucking know, like, when my dad died, not so much to my dad, but he was my stepdad. Because my biological dad, I don't know if he's watching this, but dad, I love you, man. I just, I don't know, just something about you just makes me so angry, like, I know I'll say some things that piss you off, and my mom is strict too, like, that's not who I am, like, I cuss a lot, I goof off a lot. And I say a lot of savage type stuff, you know, uh, it's savage life, you know, so I want to thank Savage Life for sponsoring this, so you guys are really good to me, guys, so you guys are my family, for real, like, I don't know how else I actually say that, because, you know, they always say the grass is greener on the other side, but, you know, sometimes you got to live in the present. And don't worry about the future, cause you know you can't, you know you can't, you, know, you can't fortune tell and just you know jump into the future, you know. So life is not measured how much we can give, but how much we can get, you know. A hater's negative vibe is motivation for success. You know, thou who dig a hole will fall in it. What that means, thou who dig a hole will fall in it. The more you create negative stuff in your life, the more it'll hunt you in your future. You know, I'm not perfect at all, you know, I have some demons. Cause I was diagnosed with bipolar schizophrenia in 2015. And at that time, I spent that mental asylum. It really opened my eyes on the world. You know, so. I grew to hate people, like. I was scared for my life, like, I don't. I don't know, so, and sometimes you just, you gotta pray, because I'm a Christian man, guys, I pray a lot, and I keep my Bible, right now. let's 
two years. I pray. I have a Bible with my name on it. That Bible means the world to me, guys. So, I got it through the mentoring program back when I was in the Young Lions mentoring program. And I re I be reading through my Bible and I be writing music and stuff. I always write in this book. It's my Christian book. So, I always journal my thoughts and everything. So, I'm not all bad. Like, literally, I'm not all bad. Yes, I have some problems. But what person don't? Like, you know, journaling helps me think. You know, it helps me get out of places where I thought I was. But, you know, it, I, as I read back to those scripts, I learn what's really out there on the other side. Like, the grass is greener on the side. It's just not physically walking somewhere. But, you know, it's just life, you know, just, you know, it's just hard out here, man. I'm sorry. Really sorry. Shout out to my family. Shout out to everyone I ever hurt. You know, I even beat my ex-girlfriend, like, literally, like, schizophrenia took over my life. And I attacked her. Even though she's not innocent. She's not an angel. She literally was teasing me. And she started playing around behind my back. And it made me really, really jealous. That I thought she was messing around. So she made me the victim. And punished me. For defending myself. To get back at her. So it ended up being kind of attacked each other you know so I was just angry you know it's just and my mother my biological mother <sighs> this really hurts me to say this guys my biological mother she left me I was left at four months old and when she left I was forced to be in an adoptive home not so much forced but I was taken in by a woman named Emma Ray my stepmom and she goes through so much people always trying to get her in trouble Yes, yeah, she's a bitter old woman, but she does so much for everybody. That's the one thing people will never understand. Like, they're always so quick to attack. That they don't truly see what's really out there. And see her worth. Like, I just... I don't want my mom to commit suicide or anything, but... That's why I'm planning on moving out soon, so I can leave her alone. Like... She deserves that space to live her life. You know, it's going to be a struggle if I have to work my ass off and work every day. But I'm really working hard. A lot of people want justice on me. But you know, justice has been served and you know, I learned my lesson. So I just want to thank everyone for helping me out and everyone that's subscribing. Thank you.